My kitchen is a bit of a mess. So I'm gonna go ahead and clean all this up and then make some coffee. making some breakfast for Jack and I, but I actually just booked a sort of impromptu trip to the Bahamas and, oh. Okay, so basically my credit card limit wasn't high enough for me to book the whole thing on my card, who told me to go buy a $2,000 iPhone two days ago. Um, I still wanted to get the cash back point, so I was like, it's fine. I'll just put the maximum amount that I can on my card. I wasn't at my credit limit, but I only had like part of what I needed anyway. And then I was like, I'll just put the rest on Jack's card. And the entire time I was thinking that the trip was a thousand dollars cheaper than it actually is. So when I put everything through, my card went through because I used like exactly how much I had left, but Jack's declined. Now I don't really know if it's booked or not booked or what's gonna happen. I am going to be very, very angry if they try to say like, well, we can't refund you your money, but here's a travel credit. Ugh. It says, congrats, your vacation is booked. But when I scroll down, it also says that Jack's card declined. So I'm hoping that they could clear that up um we don't leave until thursday it is monday right now so i'm hoping that my apple store charge posts so that i can pay that off and then just pay jack's portion from my credit card if that doesn't work then honestly it's not that big of a deal as long as they let me pay the remainder from my debit then we're good but that's how my morning's going as you guys saw earlier i got up i did some morning yoga made myself an iced coffee and i'm just vibing today is officially the first day since i quit my job that i would have been going to work but i'm not going to work she is unemployed for the moment i don't know if you guys can tell you probably can oh my gosh i'm sitting right by the window in my living room i love the natural light in this place but i'm actually filming with the front camera of my new phone i traded up from the iphone xr to the 13 pro max this is not only my first pro iPhone, but it's also my first max iPhone. And I am absolutely loving it, especially the jump from like the single cam XR to the triple cam 13 Pro Max. And the front camera on this phone is amazing. So yeah, enjoying that for sure. But yeah, I guess I will keep you guys updated on how this whole trip booking thing goes. I really hope we get to go. I wasn't sure if we'd be able to go because right now, Corona, who is actually sitting right there, hi baby, 
She hasn't been feeling too well for the past little while. We took her to the vet. At first they thought she had a urinary tract infection, but then when they did all the tests and stuff, they found that she didn't have a UTI. It's actually like urinary crystals. So they put her on a new food and gave her antibiotics and probiotics because the antibiotics gave her diarrhea. So she's just, she's been going through a lot. Um, I'm giving her a lot of love and wet food and Hopefully she feels a lot better soon. But the point of that rant there was that we weren't sure if we'd be able to go because she is on antibiotics twice a day, probiotic once a day, or prebiotic, can't remember, and the special food. And since it's just Jack and I here, it's not as easy as just leaving her and making sure she has enough food and water for the week and, you know, sending my mom over every now and then to like just check on her and clean the litter box. There would have to be somebody here with her basically all day every day to make sure that she's okay or at least twice a day to give her her meds but very like sweetly and graciously and generously Jack's older sister has offered to cat sit for us so she's just going to I guess be popping by here to give her her medicine and stuff. This is actually the first time since I was legally the minimum age required to work that I have not had a job. Like I've literally always had at least one job, sometimes two, sometimes three. So yeah, this is definitely new for me having a little bit of time off. I have three weeks until I start my new job. And it just so happened to work out that Jack also got a new job that starts in, I wanna say two weeks. So it's like a very rare time right now where we'll both be off. So we wanted to take the opportunity to actually go somewhere and do something. It's been two years almost. It'll be two years next month since we last traveled, but yeah, we just figured now was the best time and really the only time possibly for a while that we'd be able to go somewhere like this. So we figured why not? Okay. So I'm back home now. I was able to fix the issue with the booking. I'm like shaking the camera. But yeah, I was able to fix the issue with the booking. So we are all set to go to the Bahamas on Thursday. And I am excited. For the rest of the night, I'm probably just going to relax and start getting ready for the trip on Thursday. All right. Well, I am going to say goodbye for tonight and pick this up tomorrow or whenever something interesting is happening again. Guess who just found out they need a COVID test and a travel health visa before their trip in less than 48 hours. Wish me luck. And then they went, yeah, you're not on it. <laughs> but you were stressed even before then. Like, what do you mean? You got dunk? I just didn't want to be late because I didn't want them to have any reason to turn us away, which they seemed like pretty ready to. If it wasn't for that pharmacist and that person who just happened to have an appointment at 9 p.m., we would have been screwed. Yeah. Ugh. Are you going to miss us? No? Okay. <laughs> Messing around visa time. Okay, we finally have the Bahamas health visa uh, approval. So I think we're good in terms of like requirements to get in. The only things really left to do are one, pack and to get some US dollars because that's what they accept in the Bahamas. So I can like finally rest easy. I didn't 
really explain what happened at Shoppers when we went to go do our tests, but it just stressed me out and I've been so stressed out, but I'm tired. Um, so I'll explain tomorrow, but for now, everything's good. Oh, and we also booked a limo to take us to the airport tomorrow, um, or I guess technically Thursday morning, but yeah. Are you? 